What's up everyone? I'm Justin Bonard with Metalsome Moth. Welcome back for week three of Green Flash Cast Month. We've already tapped the West Coast IPA, the barley wine, and this week we're doing the Hophead Red. I know you're getting tired of hearing me say I'm really excited about this week's beer, but I really like Green Flash, and I'm excited about the Hophead Red. Green Flash calls the Hophead Red a red IPA. It's actually the first time I've ever heard that term. It's got 7% alcohol and 70 IBUs, which are both lower than the West Coast IPA, making it a little bit more sessionable. It's gonna be big and caramely up front and piney and resiny on the finish. I'm especially excited to have this on cask because the first cask scales I got into were malt forward beers like ESBs, porters, and stouts. I think this cask conditioning is gonna be really nice on this Hophead Red. Uh, it's also just a rare treat. You don't ever see Hophead Red on draft, let alone on cask. I also want to take a moment to tell you about the Rayon Vert. Green Flash became one of my favorite beers with the first Rayon Vert I ever had. It started coming to Texas at the beginning of this year. It's a Belgian Pale Ale bottle conditioned with Britannomyces. Really light, really crisp, American hop character, and Britannomyces funk. That barnyard hints of cherry. 7% uh, alcohol, and it's my household beer. That's what I keep around the fridge all the time. Uh, from the first Rayon Vert I had, along with my bartender buddy Damon, we were in love with Rayon Vert, which actually means green flash in French. Bunch of smart asses, right? Well, come on out, check out the Hophead Red while it's around, and stick around for a Rayon Vert. Cheers.